skill program, concentration. This great skill point consumption for each spirit command, spirit point consumption for each spirit command. The extent of this effect correlates with skill level. Nice! I didn't get the uh, special point though, unfortunately. How can I get this translated? Um, this is the import copy of the game. This, it comes natively like this. Uh, if you get the Singapore or um, you get the Singapore release from an import site, they have an English version of the game on the like English translation on the disc. It's rough. Uh, if you go back and watch my Let's Play on my YouTube channel at youtube.com slash count zero OR, you will find a whole bunch um, from my back episodes. There are there are some rough bits of the translation and I point them out and kind of poke fun of them as they come up. But there is some, there is a translated version of it, but th this version is legally available for purchase translated. It plays on a PlayStation 4 without any need to uh, have any sort of translation patch or anything like that because the PS4 is region, th region free. The only thing that requires any sort of foreign PSN account is if you want to purchase the DLC, you will need to get a Singapore PSN account set up and set up um, and then get a uh, PSN a Singapore PSN card from someplace who sells them. Greetings, everyone. I am former Vice Admiral of the Jovian Navy Haruki Kur uh, Kur Kusakabe. Effective immediately, the plan with its network a plan to create a network of bosun jump points in the solar system, also known as the Hisago Plan, is under Martian successor control. We have support from all sides. In fact, one third of the Federation Army already approves of our cause. I have long warned the dangers and grave implications of bosun jumping. The Federation government, however, ignored me. They hold a monopoly on bosun jumping and use it only for their own benefit. We can no, long, can no longer afford to leave bosun jumping technology in the brave new world it could create in the hands of those who do not understand it. And we have rose up, and we have, and so we rose up. We have taken control of the bosun jump, and with it shall create a brand new society. The technology is ours. The future starts now. We are the Martian successors. We shall usher in a new world and a new order. And with that, Vice Admiral Hiroki Kisakabe of the Mars Successes asserts control of the Hisago plan. Who in the world is he? He was part of the jo he was part of the Jovian army. Now he's joined the terrorist faction. He was a significant leader of Jovian forces in the previous conflict between the Earth and the Jovians. He spat anti-Earth rhetoric until the very end. In that war, Nandisho took control of the calculation unit from the ruins of an ancient Martian civilization, but later abandoned them. Conflict was never truly resolved. Now they've taken control of bosun jump technology with designs and using that to control the world. What I've heard that bosun jumping is still a relatively unknown and little understood technology. Do the Martian successors even have a way to control it completely? Well, the pieces are on place. Eureka holds the key to their plan. Who is Eureka? Eureka Misamaru, captain of the previous Nazco. He's also a class A jumper. And what exactly is a Class A jumper? Mars was terraformed and many machines that were scared to the air affected several people. They were able to match their thoughts directly to the calculation unit, which is a mark of Martian civilization's legacy. We call them the Class A jumper, like, which is Martian civilization's legacy. That's what we're talking about with kind of rough translation here. Captain Hoshino, wait! I thought the captain of the previous Nodisco died in an accident on her, on her honeymoon. I believe she was captured by the Martian successors. You can't be serious! You want to use your Class A jumping abilities to control the cancellation unit. They use it as a way to control all of the bosun jumps. No matter when or where a bosun jump occurs, they, tra they all travel through space and time, and that unit will process all of them. In other words, by processing bosun jumps, they will effectively control every single one. Bosun jumps are currently limited to a restricted jump space known only as the Chulip. This has been designated beforehand as a restricted channel through which jumps can occur in either direction. 
but is the only channel for jumping. Because that channel is controlled by the calculation unit, pulling that unit means that one can jump anywhere and everywhere at will. Having the ability to warp short distances would completely change the tactical landscape of this war. Class A jumpers can directly access the calculation unit, which means they can control it as well. But this is all a guess based on what I know. I don't think it's ever been attempted. Everything that Mars' successor said seems to suggest they figured out how to control it, though. You think they've managed to contain both the calculation unit and Yurika Mi um, Ishumaru? Akito is piloting, indeed piloting the Black Mac, but it seems the only logical conclusion. That explains why Akito is fighting them. May I ask a question here, Captain? What is Akito's relationship with Yurika? Akito was a member of the previous Nadisco's crew. He later married Yurika. So his wife got kidnapped on their honeymoon? That's terrible! We just don't know what happened to them after, their after the honeymoon. I am assuming Akito escaped with his Class A jumping abilities and little else. But we know for sure that Akito is going it alone in order to save Yurika. And he won't respond to his former allies. He must be in so much pain. I can't believe they kidnapped innocent people just to further their own agenda. We can't let them. I hope you're safe, Akito. Captain, with Hamada's help, I've decrypted the data we received from Akito Tenkawa. Well done, Harry. Omoikane, put this up in the main monitor. This must be the work of the Martian successors. What is this? What are they towing? The image is too blurry to identify it with any certainty, but it looks like a battleship. Is there a secret weapon or something? No way! No way! Is that what I think it is? You recognize it's tow? You recognize it's tow safe? It has to be. Nothing else looks like it. It's the Yamato! Da da da! All right, Soldier's Medallion is unlocked at the factory, as is the Victory Circuit. And the Victory Circuit, those are unfamiliar. Oh, new dialogue. Nine. Gain. The door answers come in handy. I have learned that I was created, not created for the purpose of serving justice. However, this did not preclude me from knowing what is not just. You are, that's exactly right. You were created for a purpose. You get to determine the purpose for which you were created. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. A lovely phrase that humans use. Just taught it to me. Oh. So, Soldier's Medallion, which I can't buy yet, boosts my focus by 30 and did not stack with any other parts that also boost your focus. Pack customized. I have almost enough points to buy an upgrade. So, Regent, so of these, I have SP Boost. Straight up Health and Energy Regen. And boost the focus of everyone else so they can use their special attacks sooner. I'm leaning towards regular Regen, but I'm going to hold off on getting that until next turn. In the meantime, though... The next mission is going to unlock two more put um, two more DLC missions. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the show, please like and subscribe. And also consider backing my Patreon. Patreon backers get episodes up to one week early of this show and any future Let's Plays. Also, please consider backing my coffee. Uh, toss me a few bucks. Also helps support the show, and it's not a monthly obligation or anything like that.